Hey, what's up, everybody? Today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make how to make the outside of the engine that we've, that we've been building for the past three videos. So now, this is going to be how to make some stuff, some of the stuff on the outside. First, let me just fix my gamma a little, like 50% on it. But there we go. Can't wait. Uh, today, we're going to be showing you guys how to make some core cool outside features of this bad boy. So, if, like, this is the mansion that we've been building on the video for about or for about a couple days now. And now it's time to do the final tutorial. It is how to build the outside. So, well, some of the outside parts. That's it. You don't have to do this, but you can if you want. Like, hey, they might build swimming. Like, we're going to be building possibly, probably a swimming pool. We're going to probably be building, you know, like a really cool, like, fancy walkway. Maybe some cool fancy other stuff to run around the house. But yeah, first up, we're gonna probably try to start with you know how we just start with the entrance first. So I want you to have a how like how we just go and grab yourself here. Polish and it's like go ahead and grab yourself some right there. There they are. Stone pressure pl and stone pressure plates. Go ahead and grab yourself some normal and it's like. And also grab yourself some gravel. So now this is gonna be able to be used there's some really good ideas. So, first stop starting off with go ahead and like and mark, like go ahead and mark a four by or five space like that. One, two, three, four, five. Like, and the ground right in front. First, you fix this. So, like, just go ahead, just make a five. Make like the perfective. Make sure there's one um, block broken on the edge of this, and just make the entire thing like that. So just like that. One, two, three, four, five. And then make this go out uh, at least uh, this far out. Which this far out is about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen blocks starting with this block right here. Just go back by fifteen, do the same thing on the other side. And then you just want to go ahead and just try to break this all up. All right, so I'm trying to just like break it all up. And you can do all sorts of this other stuff. All right, there you go. Then you should have some something that should look a little bit like this. Or if you want to also want to, you can go like this, meet this. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to just make, make patterns of everything. So starting with this, you're going to do polished andesite, andesite, gravel, polished andesite, Andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel. I'm gonna actually move this closer. Poly, polished andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel. And then you also, they're going back, you just want to go opposite. So polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, and andesite gravel. Polished andesite, andesite, gra no, gravel. Polished andesite, andesite, gravel. Polished andesite, andesite, gravel. Polished andesite. Then you should have something that should look a little bit like that. I'll say to then starting from this entrance, you're going to go polished andesite, andesite, gravel. Polished andesite, andesite, gravel. No, that's not in gravel. No. Polished andesite, Andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite. Then starting, then starting with this side, you want to go polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite. You should have something that should look a little bit like this to make like a like, a, like an actual like more of like a rocky texture. And then starting from here, you're probably gonna do polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel. No, we don't need that yet. Polished okay, gravel, polished andesite. Okay, polished andesite, andesite gravel. Polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel, polished andesite, andesite gravel. 
that will give you this really nice effect. But then that's when your stone pressure plates come in. You just you could just place ground on ground on these on right here anywhere you want to make it have like a bumpy attack. Like you're making it have like a a bumpy kind of attack. You can place these anywhere you want. And I'm just doing it like that. Then you'll have like this cool bumpy road tent uh, thing. But when you walk on it, it's gonna make sounds, but that's just the way it makes it look nice. And you guys still remember in the last videos we worked on the inside. We worked on the inside. Inside walls, actual inside like stuff, and we actually then we also and we also put the make the body in the first video. And we also made the body of the mansion in the first video. But now anyway, let's just keep on going. So you don't have to play anymore if you don't want to, but here's what you're going to probably want to do now make it look even prettier. So, if you rid of all this, and all you, all you want to simply get is oak leaves. That's all you want to do. You can put oak leaves going all the way along the, the bottom of it, which makes it have a really nice effect on it. Makes, it. makes it really stand out, and it makes it have some pretty good texture and details. Onto it, so yeah. When you're done with that, just want to put some grass, some of these leaves going all the way around it. All right, all the way around it. Uh oh, I'm do the same thing again. Let's just let's just, just go all the way around the house. No, do not leave any parts around the house blank except for the part right there. Right on. Except for right here. Do not place anything above that, like go like that, because then you won't be able to get in. Just make sure it stops right here alongside of the stairs. Then your mansion will look like a little bit like this. It's like a little bit a little pretty, right? And then what you're gonna to wanna to do, you're gonna to wanna to get a oak sapling. Actually get a spruce sapling. Then what you're gonna to wanna to do to make the thing right here, you wanna put spruce, make sure you count at the end of the trail. One, two, three. Third block of sapling. One, two, three, third block sapling. Just like that. If you want, you can make them instantly grow. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. And I did not mean to do that, but okay. Please give me a sec, guys. I, I did not mean to place that in. There. There we go. That took that. Thirteen from that one, and look at there. Then you have something that should look a little bit like this, just like a little bit more fancy. And then you're gonna also, so like now we're gonna go and do, we're gonna make a trail, not like one of these kind of trails, it's like a normal kind of trail. You're just gonna go about three blocks all the way around the house, along the side of the leaves. So, how about we use uh, granite? Let's use granite, polished granite. Guys, get polished granite. And we're just gonna make a trail back that goes three long along the back. So while I'm doing this, guys, this will, this is a really long process right here, but it's worth doing because it makes everything look nice. I'm doing. I guess I'll talk to you guys. So yeah, guys. Today, sooner or later, we're gonna be going. We're gonna, we're gonna be going to go get me a brand new fish. Yay! And I'm pretty excited for that. And also, and also, I got one comment that's saying. I'm gonna, I can't wait for the next video. Thank you very much. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a shout out. I'm gonna act like I'm gonna have to give you a shout out in the next video. So yeah. Thank, anyway, anyway, thank you for watching my channel. Thank you very, very much for watching my channel. And I'm gonna be doing more Minecraft. You don't have to wait. I'm just gonna be. I do now Hot Wheels mainly for Minecraft Hot Wheels. And I'm playing Jurassic World the game again because I stopped playing Jurassic World the game because it kept scamming me. It, and it also made me lose my account for good, but then I was able to get my account back. So I don't know exactly what happened. I was able to fix my Facebook account and everything. So yeah, I'm pretty, so I'm very, I'm pretty happy about that. And now I get to keep my level 20 and Dominus Rex and stuff. So yeah, but like also um, like there's also some stuff that my fans are not really liking about what I do. Me tell you, me, like, me tell you the truth, I don't, know, I don't even know what they're not liking, but they're not liking something. 
and I'm pretty sure it is the Jurassic World the game videos. But I, I don't, I'm like I'm just not sure though. I'm just currently like not sure if that's what they're not liking. Cause every single Jurassic World the game or stuff or dinosaur the games I games I do, I'm not hardly not getting. And almost probably li like almost literally, almost no views. I'm getting almost no views from those ones. Then I have like no idea why. So you could just um just like like and like like I said guys, and also make sure you um. You guys, if you guys want me to do some more tutorials and doing stuff like this, tell me in the comments about about like what I should design. I'll design something that you guys want me to design in the comments. Yeah, I will definitely do that for you guys. So, yeah. So yeah, guys. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead. Now go like all the way around like this. Now I'm just going to completely just, like I said, I'm just going all the way around with polished granite. Because like, as a, cause like polished granite it is not really used a lot, so I just, that's why I'm just deciding to go ahead and use polished granite. There we go, 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 there we go. And I always thought granite was not pink. I've always thought granite was like white black, but no. Like white with black spots, but no. It appears granite is pink and black. But like, anyway though, um, but like anyway though, I'm just, I'm really excited to get my brand new fish. It's gonna be very exciting. I get to finally have me a new beta. Tank's still good. I'd have to let her get used to well, like him, him or her. You know, it's gonna, I don't know what it's gonna be. I don't know if it's gonna be male or female. I hope it's gonna be a male or something. Cause just like I like your fisher, you have to mix a male and a female together. There's not a male and a male. So. There we go. Veggie witchy after that you should have something that should look a little bit like that guys so I'll go all the way around you can see it's this full polished granite and everything but now I already know you guys want me to go and start building a pool so we're gonna so you guys just go ahead and come to the back and this is if you got like for a mansion like this you're gonna want a big big pool so like try to find all right so here's the I guess what you guys are gonna try to do find like where the windows are, count down. Like where the bricks are, one, two, and on the second block, and on the second block, I'm gonna go up. I'm gonna go up there one. They're gonna count on the on the second from the second brick. Starting from right, right, starting right here next to the polished in the site. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On seventh block, place a block. And just do simply do the same thing on the other side. Find the second. Come in. And count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seventh block, place a block. Just like that. Or, here's another thing you guys can do to make it bigger. It's like, also just make sure, you can also just put, make sure you're like on the second window, right in the center, place a block. You know, you know that's also what you can do. Take that. There you go. If that's, if that's how you can make the pool a little bit bigger. And now for the pool, here's what you guys are going to want to get. Get a block of quartz. Get just grab yourself uh, some quartz stairs. Grab yourself some water. And also grab yourself some polished in side. Now, how about you grab yourself some um, chiseled stone bricks? All right. So first up, no, I ain't glowstone. Now, how about any sea lanterns? Yeah, sea lanterns will work better. So then, starting underneath this block, quickly break it to where you feel just that you'll know. Just so that you'll know. You want to make sure you have two holes right there, okay? And starting here, you just want to connect these both together. Just like that. Now, here's what you're going to want to do next. So, count down by one. I'll, like, I'm going as I go. Okay, so, start starting for, like, going this way. Go by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
9, 10. So that'd be one, yeah, one, two, three, three, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, how about you do it by one more? By eleven. There you go. No, by twelve. So there you go. Then now, you're just gonna to wanna to try to make this go all the way back until you line up. Until you until you line up with this edge right here. So then you're gonna to wanna to just connect them together, and that's the width of your pool for your mansion. So now we want you to go ahead and get all those mined. But the reason I'm putting, you know, separating one blocks by one, because you're going to be seeing exactly why. Said like, all I want to do now is just break this all in the center for now. It's going to be a little bit deeper. Don't do this. Don't have anything. It's going to be a little bit deeper, but so yeah. Um, there we go. Yep, the edge is going to be just a little bit deeper. Hang on. I don't know if you guys can hear that plane that just went over us outside. There's a plane that's outside. The plane just flew over us. <laughs> I like the sound of that, though. And I'm sorry, guys, I'm like, I'm doing more Hot Wheels than you think. It's just because Hot Wheels is going become really popular. I'm going to be collecting Matchbox cars soon as well. Because. And now, here's, come, here's the part when your block of quartz comes in. This goes, no, they just go all the way around the border of your pool with quartz. With the quartz. Block, or play, a block of quartz. Right, like I said, let's go all completely around the borders. And there you go. So now, here's what you're going to want to do next. So, what you're going to want to do now is you're going to want to mine down by simply three. You want to do this going all the way around until you reach the half point. So I'm going to go ahead and march, mark, or march, <laughs> mark the half point. So I like to do it like this. I just like to find, I just like to get blocks like this. I just place, like to place two on both sides until I actually reach the center. The center. And it looks like my center is right here, and I'm just going to mark it. I'm going to do the same thing, and I'm going to also mark it along the other side, just like that. That will be marked. That will be the mark. So then, that's when you're just going to want to go, like, for yawn, like, you know, one side. You don't have to do one on all, but on one side, break it down by three. When I'm doing this, I'm going to also talk to you guys. So, um, you guys might be wondering exactly how I am always designing these things. It's just because... I'm thinking in my head about like, what will these people, what will my people, my fans, like want to see me build? Like, what will they want to see me build? So I'm always thinking about that. So then I always so then that's when I'm like always doing all this stuff. And I'll, after this, after this tutorial, I'll be doing a vlog or about me going to go get my beta as well. I'm going to be doing a vlog. And it's going to be a nice and beautiful vlog. I hope. How long have I been filming real quick? Let's see. I've been filming for 19 minutes. After I'm done doing this, I'll just tell you guys exactly what to do. Then I'll stop and I'll quickly play the video. Or I might do a time lapse and just connect them all together. So... Yeah, now what you're going to want to do is you're just going to want to simply um, break the edges right here and then replace them all with quartz. Replace everything with quartz. And I'll leave the time lapse real quick. Let me see if you see in a sec. Alright, guys, I'm back. So, yeah. Sorry, the time lapse wasn't like as weird as like it's right because I actually had to zoom it in. I feel like I actually had to zoom it in because they won't let me zoom them because I'm on an iPhone. But yeah, it was like, like I said, you just want, just like, all I wanted to do is just want to go ahead and just completely, like, fill that in. 
But now with the quartz stairs, you're just going to want to simply go all the way along the bottom like this with it. Okay, just because it makes it have a much nice, like, nicer effect with it. And there you go. That's your deepest, there's your deeper part right there. And then so far. Then you also want to go ahead after one block break. So, because right now we're going to be putting the sea lanterns in because then they're going to be used for the lighting. So if I can, there we go. Just like that. So then, all you just want to go ahead and quickly do now is just put the sea lanterns in. These are going to be used for the lighting. So then that's your whole deep end without water so far. And then, again, you're just going to want to do the same thing with this side, but except, except this is going to only be two blocks deep. So, I'll do the time lapse real quick, so like you just want to go by two blocks deep. Then you're just going to want to replace it. How about, like, no, how about just one block? Yeah, one block instead. But it's going to appear two blocks, so. I mean, then you could also go ahead and get rid of your mark. And there we go. So now, again, you're just going to want to go ahead and fill in all the value around the edges. We do the time. Let me get the time was ready. All right, so there we go, guys. I had this. It was on my phone. Was after from the time lapse. I had to, it was completely zoomed out. So I had to. Sorry about that, guys. I just had to completely zoom it back in. But yeah, guys. Once you are done, you should then have the. You should then have part of the new of the fellow in done. Then once you're done, how much you get to here? Mine this first block right here, and then just replace that with the stairs. So you wanna. Make sure, make it to where you can actually walk up and get to the stairs, get to everything. So you're going right there. And then also, you're just going to want to do this again by making this. Because it's just, just that you can actually walk around. But also, along the edge, go like this. Because you want to make it to where it like folds in like this to make it look nice. Just like that. And then for the exit, here's what you're going to want to do. Part, but go right here. Count one. From here, one, two, three. On that, go one, two, three. Do it one more. That will give a centerpiece. And then all you're going to want to do then is just go like that. And then there you go. You got your exit. You got your exit. So. I'm just, I don't know, how do we do this? So like when you're walking up like this, you can just jump out like that. So, yeah, so now, all you're going to want to do now is just simply fill this up with water. That's all you're going to want to do now. For the, for, for uh, like right now we're just working with the deep end. So first up, we're actually some lighting in here. So go like, put one, like, hold on. I'll get it done and I'll show you what I mean. So I'll, if this more for like, Okay, I don't guess it's gonna work right. <laughs> there. And then you just wanna wanna simply put your lighting in. So like and that means in that case you don't wanna put the stairs in the shallow end apart from the center. Okay, let's get rid of this. And then that. Do then there you go. You go. Oh, you also put that. Also put on right here on the edge. And then where the only place place there's not gonna be lighting is there in the center. That's like the only place where there's not gonna be any lighting. Okay. And then there we go. Now it's just completely, now it's just continue on filling up the pool with water. Now 
we're gonna get one more layer. Really deep in. Like two more layers actually. Then you then that's when you're gonna wanna that's when it's gonna start going to the shallow. Just like that. And y'all go. Then you got your little pool. You know, so here's something I'd like to do with it. No, I'm just kidding. I was like, this will make it have a really weird effect. See, it'll just make it be like there's floating, floating water. So never mind. And now, you wait. So now, here comes the harder part. You know, going all the way around the pool, go like one, two, three. It makes, make, like, around the corner of the pool, every. Every corner along the pool, just put, um, oh, stretch it out, stretch out, um, off, stretch up upright diagonals by six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Sure. On all sides, on all no corners, one, two, three, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. Four, five, six, and then there you go. That's gonna be where you're gonna be using the stone bricks, the chiseled stone bricks. Now, all right. So then, starting from this uh, next upright diagonal, just connect it. So like I was like all the top upright diagonals, you're just gonna want to connect them all. Just by going like this. You'll see what I mean in a second. So I literally think it go all the way around the whole mansion. Not the whole mansion, no, never mind, just around the whole pool. But and also make sure they're the um, they're connected. And then once you're done with that, you should have something that should look a little bit like this. But now this part, well like my first we get rid of this real quick, just because. And like this is now when the harder hardest part comes in. It's a probably the longest part of the outside that's putting all the chis uh, chiseled stone bricks going all like break every single one of these blocks every like inside of this stuff diameter right here break every single one of these blocks and then fill in the whole thing including the diameter all right so i'm going to get the um the, the um the time lapse ready Guys, I've just finished the thing, so like after you're done with that, you should have something that should look like this going all the way around your pool. All right, so just chiseled stone bricks going all the way around the pool. Okay, and this is where you can put all your customers and chairs and stuff at. So I'm um, go ahead and just get rid of everything in court. Like you want to put grass you can. You don't have to grab like so now. How about we first up make a um, a lounge for the lifeguard? So go ahead and put oak fence. No, we not, no, this is a public. It's not a public house. So never mind. How about we put? Hmm. How about we put? You no, know, we actually can make it have a lifeguard. I don't know why, but we could. You can we can hire somebody to work at my house. Uh, no, because I'd be like, that'd be a little too weird. But how about you put a diving board? Okay, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to put oak, get oak fence, get yourself some oak planks, and also grab yourself oak ladders, and also grab yourself some spruce wood slabs. Or how about stone slab? There. And then we then like, go ahead and you can make two diving boards, a big one and a tall one if you want to do that. Like there's some pools I have that, so I thought we'll make the how about we make a tall one first. So go ahead and count from the edge or corner right here. So go one, two, three. The third block plays a block. On the other side, one, two, three, third block plays a block. But make sure it's on the side where the stairs 
are not at. Make sure you put it all right on the other side. Okay? Never, like, so we're gonna work on the tall one first. So go up, the tall one, you're gonna wanna go up by, by five. So one, two, three, four, five. The first block you place, make, make the first block you place be one, so, like, so just like that one, two, three, four, five. Just like that. And now just put your oak wood fence right along the edge of that to get this cool effect. And then when you wanna put your ladders, and then that's when the stone slabs come inside. Come in, you come in, come in. You wanna try to place it right under the right, right, right under there, like right underneath that second block right there. You wanna make it go out by three. So that's breaking the just bring it being the first block. So one, two, three. You know, how about just that for that? There we go. So then just by two, because it makes it have a cooler effect. And then you could also do this to make it actually have like an effect that's like it's actually standing up. And there you go, then you got your little diving board, your tall diving board. That it actually works. And now, the short one, this is basically it. Just by two. You do that same thing with the top one, by two. Put um, fences along the side, and then a ladder. And then there you go. Then you got a bunch of diving boards. So like, there's a pool I went to that had, had, a small, had a small diving board for the little kids and a big diving board for the big kids. And so that's why I decided just, just to do that. Get a small diving board for the little ones. And just get a big diving board for the big ones. Wait a second. Oh, that's right. And then there you go. Then you got, you kind of got yourself your little um, diving boards. You got to you also don't have to do that. Uh oh. Oh shoot, my thing gonna snap, guys. Hold on a second. My carry case snapped. So now go ahead and get rid of that. Okay. So, and now what you're going to want to do, you're still like, now what you're going to like trying to make is you're going to try to make some chairs. All right. So, like if you, like, like I said, you could put a diving board. And if you're just going to make the diving board, do your time, you would make it. If you take your, um, you're getting, you would also get court stair. And you would just go like this, go about, find the center block, go up by like two or three, and then put the chair down and do that, and then put ladders in the front. And then you could put like ladders in the front, and then also keep placing that along the side. Maybe you put some like torches along the side of that to make like a diving board, like to make like the lifeguard, but this is just a normal, not a public pool. We are just gonna, we're just, we, that's why I'm just doing like this, just because, it just made me, because it's just made me think of because it's not a public pool, why would we need a lifeguard? If you guys agree with me. All right, and there we go. So like now we're gonna put, try to put some chairs in. Also, there's some pretty good designs for chairs. All you want to simply grab is quartz stairs and quartz slab, and there you're done. That's all you need, quartz stairs and quartz slabs. Just like, every, after every two blocks, so you're going to want to put one chair. So, one, so over two, and how about about three, actually? Like that. And, you know, I, you know just about two. About two, then two, 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 three, two, two just like that but like right along the edge right here get rid of that why because then it will not like like because then it won't like look too weird so then just do the same exact thing on the other side oh yeah, i forgot but also make it go back by like make like make them separate by two and make them go back by two you same thing on the other side go back by two 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 
two, two. We also get like there. Then you go. Then you got all your chairs along the edge like that. And then to simply place quartz slabs right in front of that for like for them like to represent like to make it represent like stairs or like to make them represent like nice designs of chairs. Then there you go. You got yourself some little tiny chairs. They're not really that small. And now you want to try to make some umbrellas that you're going to want to take. You want to take some iron bars, take some, and take some red wool. And you're, oh, here's all you're going to simply want to do. Like next to every single chair, put some iron bars. Let's like, let's like, simply like, simply just put one set of iron bars next to every single chair. And then you're going to want to do that going up. By three, so one, two, three, one, two, three, no, three, one, two, three. You can want with one, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and there you go. Do same thing on the other side. One, two, three. Number one, two, three. Then one, two, three. 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 Like that's the best. To that total, I should all be one. That should all be three. So one, two, and then three. There you go. And now, just simply do this. Just put put. First up, just put one single piece of red. On top of every single iron bar. So I'm telling you guys, this is a really tricky work, but it's but it makes everything look so nice. Do the same thing on the other side. You think you're good at doing it? And there you go. And now for then this after that, make um. Now, how about we do this? How about every, how about after every every other chair, just like this, because we'll have an umbrella. Because these umbrellas are going to be big; they could be able to go over all like both of the, almost both of the chairs. So maybe just go like that. And anyway, you know, guys, just do like that. Like get rid, like keep the other ones, but like, like keep the ones along the edge, you know, like this. But then all, but like then separate and get rid of one. Cause this, if I don't do, if I, if I do that, if I don't do it that way, it's gonna look really weird, which we don't want that. This is gonna look like a gigantic umbrella connected together. Oh, shoot. Okay, so, one, two, three, and there. And then get rid of that. And there you go. So then all you're gonna wanna do is put a cross over both. Over both, or but all of them, the cross, 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 just like that, and then you simply place a block right on top of those, just like this, and then try to break the block on the inside of that and place iron bars. I'll show you that in a sec after I get this done. And then there you go. If you want to make them bigger, here's what you can do. You can just simply go underneath them by another one. Like this to make the umbrellas bigger if you want to make them a little bit bigger. You don't have to, but you can. Then you'll have some big umbrellas like this. You can still just like stand right here next to inside of them, but you can do whatever you want. I'm doing this, I'm doing it this way, just because I think it looks better. Then we just, you can just break the inside block and just simply do, and just simply place iron bars along the inside of that. And then there we go. Now I think that I could finish off our pool in the back. But what else do we need in the back of our or back in, on the back of this? What else do we need? I think we need a hot tub. So we're gonna just simply connect this all together. So right along the edge um this um 
get your chisel cut on the stone bricks. And this is make a, um, on both sides do this, make, make a path on both sides. Make sure, make, make, make sure, um, uh, uh, like, make sure like that. Meets the other side. And I'm so sorry if I'm talking very fast, guys. I can't help it. I can't help it whatsoever. And then there we go. Just make sure it meets. And then all you're just going to want to do is fill this in. So I'm going to just do this on camera because it's not going to take too long on camera. This, this, like, this is not going to take too long. It's probably not even going to take as long as it did. As it cold took just to fill up. All right, so then you're just going to want to do this. You want to make a very big thing of stuff going wrong you going around the edge just to make it have some of that cool stuff, all the nice stuff. Okay, you're going to keep on going. Going all the way around. Well, not, not like, not, I'm just kidding, not all the way around. I'll just put it right along the edges. Along the edges. There we go, keep on going. There we go. But like this is like since this is a mansion, you want to make sure you're like a lot of people want to live in a mansion. Is that mine only has two? Mine only has to fit two people, but who cares? Anybody like they may have like a lot of friends and they want to come swim anytime. They got they got they got a big ginormous pool to come swim at. And then you're just. Alright guys, I want to let you guys know I am playing on the PS3 right now. So if you guys have a PS3 and you want to play Minecraft with me, just tell me in the comments what your username is and I'll send you a game. And I'll send you, and you can send me, but I'll send you an invitation, like a friend request. And I'll send you guys a friend request and maybe we can play some games together in Minecraft one day. Just make sure you guys please tell me your name or Minecraft if you have a PS3. It only, it only, it only, it only works if you have a PS3. They tell me your name, they send me the friend, then I'll send you the friend request, then we can play some games together. Well, anyway, after you're done doing that, you want to have a big, big layout just like that. Alright, and then, like, we're just, the hot tubs are going to be very small, but all you're going to want to take is block of quartz, some birch with oak wood stairs, and then you're going to also want to take your water bucket. And now, here's what you're going to want to do now to make the hot tub. The hot tub's just going to be a simple two blocks high, so it's just going to be so starting along the edge on this side, or you can do it. On, you can do it on any side. It don't. It don't really matter. You know, I'm going to do it on this side, on the side where the um, diving boards are. So here's all I'm just going to simply do. It's going to not be. It's not going to be a very big hot tub, but at least it's going to be a nice hot tub. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five. Just by simply five blocks. One, one, two, three, four. Make sure it's four. Like you're just going to first like. Here, look, here's a simple way to do it. Um, I'll show you, like, um, find, like, you can do this at any point. You can do this at any point, but, like, place one single block, one block away from the actual edge. Like, 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 like skip a block, so go, like, one, then place a block right there on the second block. And then just simply place four going on one side, four going on the other. There you go. Then you have, like, your big radius. And then just try to connect them, just like that. Then you're just going to want to make it an additional layer high. And then make it put like put like seats and stuff in. You're just going to want to simply put some of these some stairs in, straight in, just like this. And then break the bottom block like that. And then you have some like little seats inside your hot tub. Or you could not put that, you could just make it be like this. You want to make it a bit shorter. And you could just put a simple block inside there, but that, I don't think that looks good. I, I, I think you guys agree. So I just like to put an additional layer. No, I won't do that. It don't, this one, that won't really matter because I think it'll make it look more like an actual hot tub. Then you're just going to want to go this around like this, and then just put more water like that, and there you go. You've got your little hot tub. Just put. I'm going to put a seed lantern on the bottom of that right here. Actually, there we go. And. And after you make it to where you can actually get in, I'm gonna do like I'm gonna put some stairs going all the way around, which is why you want the three, which is why you wanted to not build that one. So you can actually put stairs in like this. And then there you go. Then you got yourself your little hot tub. And you also you wanna do it again, you gotta go like this all the way around. 
Oh, oh yeah, never mind. I think that looks better. Look at that. That looks even better. It's like a little tub. You can just walk straight in. You go like straight like that. You get out. Just hop. You go like that. You can actually sit down. You can tell underwater, but the thing is, it just don't look that weird. And then there you go. And then you've got, I guess, a little hot tub. And now, if you want to know, like, what else do we have outside of a, of a house? How about we put, like, a grill station? Here's what I, here's where I like, here's the way I like to make a grill. I, go, like, I like to go like this. I like to get another brick, I like to get another brick fence. I also like to get black concrete. I also like to get, right, I also like to get iron trap doors. And to make me a good grill station, I'm going to put it over here. I'm just going to simply place two, and you can place this anywhere. Then put black concrete, and then put iron trap door. Let's make like an okay grill station, or if you want to make it be a little bit lower, here's what I would prefer you guys do. Put, I'm um, not polishing this one, not that. Pick up, fix that. Get rid of that polish and the site. And then, I, or either like sometimes I just like to go like this. I like to take, um, um, not, not, not like not that, but I also sometimes I like to take another brick fence, make it upside down. Make them upside down and then put this on top to make it uh, like a kind of okay grill station. I guess you can have a grill or make another better okay grill station. I like to take end rods. Just put them underneath there like that to make it like an okay kind of table and it also makes it light up at night. So if I, I'll go ahead and show you that. Um, daylight. And then that day looks like it's set at night. It also lights up just just so that you can still have some sort of lighting at the grill, which is really, which is really nice. So now they got yourself a little grill station here, and then you can also put some chairs and tables for anyone. I'm gonna put some um, round tables, going like this. I'm just gonna put simple round tables. I guess I'll put a few more. Like two, two more, one along the edge too, and then there, there, and there, and then I like also then like to take my iron bars, and then pop, um, iron trap doors, and put those on top of there like that. Or you could use carpet, but I'm not using carpet because that then that'll, that'll look too weird. And then there you go, you have, you have like your little. You have yourself a little grill station so with a little bit of chairs people are going to have some time to hang around on. And there you go. What else can we put? Let's, let's put some um, chairs and tables over here near the hot tub. Yeah, I'm going to put some stuff, chairs and tables near the hot tub as well. I want to put some in the hot tub. So I'm going to put one here. And then maybe one here. And then maybe put one right onto the other side. That and just put I think that get your iron trap door. Do the same one for these ones over here. And then put some right there. Doing like come here. Nope. Like that. And there you go. I guess that's you could say your pool and your outdoor living area is done. But what else do we well like what else would you need? So how about we gonna put how about we can put a double high fence around the whole place so going out past the trees a little bit or with the trees you just want to stack up two blocks high but when no when you get over here uh, when you when you want to make the other part of the fence just simply like um still like wherever the um edge of the thing is right here just place blocks right there so i'll go and do the time lapse for that that's gonna take me a little bit so get any kind of leaves i'm gonna probably use um jungle wind leaves because I, I love jungle leaves they just look so nice look at that and I'll see you guys in a sec. Alright, but guys, I am back. And once you're done, you will have something that should look a little bit like this going all the way around. And then you know what? We are pretty much completed the whole tutorial on how to finish, how to do the whole mansion itself. And this is all of it, guys. If y'all did you enjoy this did, did enjoy my video, all your videos about me playing building this mansion, please do leave a like and subscribe. And all guys also guys tell me a nice design for anything.
you know, also guys, like I said, guys, just tell me a nice design or another kind of building that you guys would absolutely love me to build and what I should maybe like in like redo, maybe like maybe what I should fix around this house. And here we guys, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next Minecraft, and I'll see you all in the next Minecraft video. Goodbye.